The break is over. North Korea launching an intercontinental ballistic missile today. That, according to the Pentagon's initial assessment, it's North Korea's first weapons launch since September. Today's launch sent eastward, traveling about 1,000 kilometers into the Sea of Japan. Here is Donald Trump's reaction. A missile was launched a little while ago from North Korea. I will only tell you that we will take care of it. It is a situation that we will handle. North Korea launched uh, an intercontinental ballistic missile. <clears throat> uh, it went higher, frankly, than any previous shot they've taken. North Korea's missile flew for about 50 minutes before splashing into Japan's exclusive economic zone. Those details coming from Japan and the Pentagon adding the launch did not pose a threat to the U.S. or its allies. North Korea's latest test came on the heels of an update from South Korea. Seoul's unification minister says the North may announce the completion of its nuclear program within a year. Adding Pyongyang's weapon development is moving faster than expected. And Japan had given a heads up yesterday saying it detected new radio signals suggesting North Korea was preparing a weapons test. The United States is designating North Korea as a state sponsor of terrorism. Today's launch comes just over a week after Trump relisted North Korea as a state sponsor of terror. Pyongyang responded to that update, calling it a, quote, serious provocation and violent infringement. Hawaii already preparing for a nuclear test with plans in motion before today's launch to test its attack warning signal for the first time since World War II. On Friday, sirens will sound as part of the practice run. Officials say if the warning is heard outside of new monthly testing times, residents should take shelter immediately. Sirens would go off less than 15 minutes before missile impact. North Korea's weapons launch happened just after 3 a.m. local time, and there was quick response from Japan and South Korea, both holding emergency meetings today.